Anarch, what is it? What's the value? Let's talk about that next. Anarch. So the first thing we really need to talk about is uh, what's the fit? So what are the clues that you can look at to figure out if they uh, might be a solution for you? So number one, um, if you're creating complex deliverables that are like a mashup of information from many different sources, then, then you're probably a good fit. Um, so specifically, if you're creating technical data packages where you're taking a 3D model, maybe a specification, maybe legal documents, and putting it into one package that you give out for request for quote process, that's a good fit. Uh, another one would be if you're creating a model-based definition, uh, where maybe you take information out of an ERP or supply chain management system, and you add that information into a presentation view of your 3D model for a model-based definition, it's a good fit. Uh, also work instructions. So if you're taking, if you're showing an assembly process, a manufacturing process, a service process where you take a 3D model, and again, you're taking information from other systems, you want to kind of add that in, uh, then it is a good fit. So the next question is, um, why is a good fit? Uh, what does the process look like? And to kind of illustrate that, I have some graphics that I'm gonna share because it, it is a little bit more complex. So let's, let's walk through that. So first off, uh, usually when you're gonna create these types of deliverables, you go through an authoring process. Now, traditionally, you're going to do you're going to use a manual procedure there. You're going to have someone sitting in front of a, a desktop or other computer, taking information from all these different sources and actually creating it manually. The next step here is reviewing. Uh, so just because you create it doesn't mean it is completely accurate. So this involves uh, taking your deliverable attaching it in an email, sending it out to many different people um, and letting them review it, mark it up, and then sending it back. And that whole process is just rife with a lot of pain. <laughs> if you have a new version, uh, then you have to send it back out. You have the risk of people working on off the wrong versions. Um, and when you get feedback in uh, the form of multiple files from these different participants, you have to manually pull that together yourself. Lastly, when you want to publish it or share it back out, uh, same type of thing, you distribute it uh, using email. They use that to open the file attachment. And again, if you ever update that, if you ever have a new version, then you have to go through this, basically this whole process again. Um, so there's lots of room for uh, human error. There's lots of room for there's actually a lot of rework here. There's a lot of manual effort and it's not very efficient overall. So there's, there's a lot of room for improvement with that existing process. Um, and a lot of companies are looking for how they can improve it. Um, so let's take a look at how the process looks a little bit different with Anarch. It starts with that authoring process. So instead of manually creating that, Anarch has this, it's, it's almost kind of like a workflow engine that uses templates to automatically pull information from different sources and create that mashup deliverable that you want to create. And this is automated. So it kind of runs uh, in a one-off fashion or does so in a batch mode. So the next thing you do with in the Anarch based process is uh, that deliverable that you want to have reviewed is hosted in the cloud. So basically you share a URL with everyone. They visit that URL. They can view and interact with that deliverable. They can spin the 3D model uh, and they can add all of their feedback. And there's no, there's no special application that needs to be installed or need to be learned by the, these different people. They're in a browser. Um, very easy to use, uh, very uh, easy to get access to. And then when you do publish it, uh, you use the same platform. Uh, you use this cloud-based platform to share out the deliverable to everyone that needs to consume it. And again, here with this approach, if you're accessing it through a browser, 
Uh, you avoid all the nasty issues uh, that you have with email, file attachment based um, publication of the deliverable. So, so overall, you know, the process changes a good amount. You have automation on the front end and then on the back end, it's really taking advantage of all the cloud capabilities uh, that uh, you see in a lot of different applications today, but this kind of runs as a single suite that kind of goes from beginning to end. So again, if you're creating compact, complex deliverables, it's a mashup of different information, this is really gonna be a good fit and there's lots of advantages and benefits along the way. That's Anarch in a nutshell uh, and that's, that's this take. Take care and talk soon. Thank you.